Hey everyone and welcome back to Final Fantasy 15. On this video I'm going to show you how to farm lots and lots of AP very quickly. So let's head back to the car and I'll show you where I'm talking about. Huh. Okay, so the place we're going to be doing this is in the three valleys. So right here, so we're going to be heading to that parking spot to get this started. So right here. Taking a walk on the wild side? Nothing like nature in the middle of nowhere. Now, I wasn't the one who discovered uh, this technique or location, but it seems to be just sort of common knowledge at this point. So uh, I don't really have anyone to credit, unfortunately. But um, what I am going to do different than other people is just show you how I do it, and uh, I believe it's pretty efficient. <laughs> So uh, what we're going to do is we're going to go to this haven and make it morning. And the reason we're going to do that is because it only works during the daytime hours and it's already 1 o'clock, so we want to start off fresh. Let's so let's just day. camp. I'll see what I Doesn't really on. matter which food we put on. Uh, unless you're really low level and you're doing this, then you might want some uh, attack food. But at my level, it doesn't matter. It's I'm just going to grab toast or whatever. Toast it is. And I may as well put some silkus greens on, I suppose. Okay, so in order to do this, you're going to need the Shield of the Just Royal Arms. And you're also going to need the Beast Whistle. Now, I believe you can get that Royal Arms any time after you get the uh, second Royal Arms. And the Beast Whistle, I believe you get right before you encounter Titan for the first time. Well, for the first and only time. Um, so you need both of those, otherwise this isn't going to work. Also, to make it more efficient, I'm going to change some things to my gear. So let's go to gear. We are going to put on the... Uh, Trident of the Oracle Royal Arms. That's going to increase my MP by 60. So uh, makes it less likely I'll run out. Uh, we need to equip the Shield of the Just, of course. And the reason we're using the Shield of the Just is because it has a special attribute to it. When we Warp Strike with it, it hits your target and every target around it. So we've got groups of low-level enemies. We're going to Warp Strike them. It's going to kill the target and all the others. Uh, we're going to go to our accessories and we're gonna put on the Thieves Way 2 which I believe we got out of uh, Castle Mark Tower and that reduces the MP cost of phasing which appears to also include warp striking so that'll help and we're also gonna switch out our outfit we're gonna go from the kingly raiment to the kingly raiment no jacket and that's gonna increase our magicka region Okay, so we're pretty much we'll ready to go. So all we're going to do, we're going to have a shield of the just equipped. And we need to clean out these guys first. That'll be really quick. So you just warp strike in and it just blows up everything around your target. So got a decent amount of AP from that, but that's not where the real AP comes from. So you're going to use your summon enemies, your beast whistle. And some enemies are going to show up, and you're going to warp strike them and kill them before you even get into combat. So we're going to summon them. We go. Indeed. Sometimes they don't appear right away, and that one screwed up, unfortunately. So you don't want to be in combat, and the reason for that is because he'll do an animation at the end. He'll, like, wipe his hands or whatever. So let's see if we can do this correctly. So there's the group. We warp strike, and oh, kind of split again. So, this is a bad start here. So, let's let him do his animation. That time he did a finch, uh, fist clinch. Hopefully it'll work this time. Let's see here. Alright, so... And once again, messed up. Weird. Well, of course, when I'm trying to show you, uh, it's not working as intended, but... Hopefully those are just one-offs. No, once again, one of them got away. Okay, well, it's being stubborn at the moment. Once we get into the groove, it should be okay. 
Okay, there we go. You can see I killed that group before they spawn. Now I can just summon another and rinse and repeat. And you can go really fast. Although, once again, they're being split apart. And I haven't experienced this to this degree before. I mean, every once in a while you get them split apart, but this is like almost every group. So this is kind of weird, but there we go. That's how it's supposed to be. And then you can just kind of switch back and forth and continue to do it but had another one spread apart that time but was able to take him out so this is all that it is you just do this over and over again and the ap racks up really quick now i haven't uh actually um tested it to see how much i actually get in an hour but that's what i'm gonna do here so if i had to guess i'm gonna say it's probably a thousand an hour but uh we're gonna find out so I'm going to keep doing this for an hour. We're, we'll come back and see where I'm at. And most likely it's going to turn to dark uh, before that hour's up. I'm almost sure it will because I don't think the days are that long. So uh, counted in that hour, we'll be returning to that haven and sleeping. So just keep that in mind. If I could continue to go all night, it would be more. But unfortunately, you can't do that. And I think that one got away from the group. Oh, nope. That one's good too. So yeah, you can see it's not being as stubborn now. But anyways, let's jump forward an hour. Let's see how much I earn. Uh, I'm currently at 564, so we'll see what my total is in an hour. Okay, so I'm approaching the one hour mark now and the end of my second day cycle. So it looks like a full day cycle will run you almost exactly a half an hour. And oh, that one screwed up. Been having a pretty good luck with them being grouped up together, but we'll just do a few more groups and then we'll check my AP. I think it's gonna be an astronomical amount. Eyes forward. So that group's dead. Let's say uh, two more groups. And last one. Sounds good. Boom! Extra four. Okay, the moment of truth. How much AP did I get? And holy crap, it looks like, uh, what did we start with? 546? So that would put us at about, uh, why can't I do this math? 14, or not 14, it would be uh, 13, like 70? Yeah, somewhere around there. For some reason, my brain is like, no math, probably because I've been grinding for a whole hour. But anyways, uh, just shy of 1,400 AP, so uh, that is a lot. That is a ton. And of course, that's counting the time I took to go to the Haven and rest, so that's not like in a vacuum. That's actually practical. You can get 1,350 AP or more an hour at this spot using this technique. So anyways, it works. Massive AP if you don't mind grinding. And now I've got to figure out what I'm going to spend all that AP on. But anyways, that's what I wanted to show you on, that, on this video. So that's going to be it for now. So thank you for watching and I will see you next time.